Okay, so um, today we're going to be talking about feminism and what it implies. These are people. Um, okay, uh, why don't you all introduce yourselves? Guppy first. Oh, she already introduced me. I'm uh, Guppy. I'm Shan. I'm okay, Ayla. Um, <laughs> all right, so our first question, um, what do these images mean? Basically, um, what do all of these different facts about feminism on this website imply uh, as, uh, as a whole and separately? What do they mean? I think they mean, like, they just really represent how the ideal image of a woman has changed over time and overall how um, it's all very different in terms of images, but at the same time it's exactly the same of how there's always something that some woman should look like. Mm -hmm. It also shows like what women were born to do, sort of. Like that's what people thought they were born to do. Not necessarily what they were Yeah, born you to phrased that very badly. Like, <laughs> but like what they thought they were born to do at the time mm -hmm. and how that evolved and then what the ideal of for women were. And how do you think what w women supposedly were born to do, how do you think that's changed from, say, like, the 1950s to 2010? Well, before, like, women just kind of went along with it. They never fought against it or said anything against it. But now they realize that they want to be equal and want to have, like, the same rights as men. So they fought for it, and hence now it's changed. Um, okay, so what do you think that all of these uh, various facts and like the ideal woman and um, what women were supposedly born to do, what do you think that um, says about American society as a whole? Do you think it reflects well on American society? Not at all. Yeah. Well, Why? Like, prior to like 2000, I d it did not reflect well. Yeah, maybe it reflected the actual time period of the image. Mm -hmm. Well, um, do you think that uh, women have particularly equal rights at this point in time? They did have equal rights at the time, and that equal rights doesn't change much uh, at the time that uh, women are persuaded to be housewives. They already have the right to vote. and. Uh, Try to be involved into politics, but uh, because all the media says that it is a shame for women to involve in these things, so although they they have the right to do it, they don't do it. Um. Well, I wouldn't say that they have equal rights. Like, for example, a woman still, on average, gets paid seventy cents to a man's dollar for various jobs. But um, it is definitely uh, true that. There's a societal stigma against women partaking in particularly difficult or like legitimate jobs. Um, how do you think that stigma has evolved throughout time? I think it like changes over time. Like they do like more and more things as time goes on. Like it starts off where it's like being the housewife is what every woman does, and now like and up until now, there's women in politics and stuff like that. Does women have other jobs? Does anyone have any closing remarks? Women. <laughs> <laughs> well, on that note, <clears throat> anything else? No. All right. Goodbye.